Yes? Professor Norman, my name's Lucy. I just read all your research on the human brain. We need to meet. <laughs> all of my research? Well, I'm very flattered, young lady, but I find that hard to believe. I must have written no less than... 6,734 pages. I can recite them to you all by heart, if you wish. Are you one of Emily's friends? This sounds like one of her silly jokes. Is she there with you? No, I'm on my own. Who are you? I just told you. Uh, Lucy, right? Yes, sorry. I read your theory on the use of the brain's capacity. It's a little rudimentary, but you're on the right track. Thank you. Professor, my cells are reproducing at a phenomenal speed, several million per second. I'm having trouble precisely evaluating the time of my death, but I doubt it'll last more than 24 hours. What are you talking about? What I'm saying is that your theory is not a theory. I absorbed a large quantity of synthetic CPH4 that will allow me to use 100% of my cerebral capacity. Right now, I'm at 28%. And what you wrote is true. Once the brain reaches 20%, it opens up and expands the rest. There are no more obstacles. They fall away like dominoes. I'm colonizing my own brain. Uh, well, I, <clears throat> I don't know what to say. It's true, I've, I've, I've been working on this theory for over 20 years, but it's, it's only oh, ever been hypotheses and research ideas. I, I never thought anyone would. You can control your own metabolism? Yes. And I can start to control other people's bodies. Also, I can control magnetic and electric waves. Um, not all of them, just the most basic. Television. Telephone. Radio. That's amazing. I don't feel pain. Fear desire it's like all things that make us human are fading away it's like the less human I feel all this knowledge about everything quantum physics applied mathematics the infinite capacity of a cell's nucleus they're all exploding inside my brain all this knowledge I don't know what to do with it If you're asking me what to do, I... You know... If you think about the very nature of life, I mean, from the very beginning, the development of the first cell divided into two cells. This whole purpose of life has been to pass on what was learned. That there was no higher purpose. So if you're asking me what to do with all this knowledge you're accumulating, I say, pass it on. Just like any simple cell going through time. Time? Yes, of course. I'll be at your door in 12 hours.